Okay, dining room. This is the entryway. <coughs> Um, probably 10 foot ceilings. That's going to be eight, nine, ten. I have a tape. Okay, this is, I don't know, dining room maybe. Kitchen. The outside wall out there is mm, 20 feet away. Okay, pantry is pretty small. What is that thing at the bottom? Is that the phone case? Oh, okay. Toilet behind the door, shower there. Oh, pretty. Get some light. There we go. Oops. Front bedroom. Got a little closet. I don't think we got to the master yet. <clears throat> Let's do the master. Funky chicken stairs, spiral staircase. The ceiling is cool. Got kind of that uh, round dome, which is <clears throat> nice. It's a long master bedroom. The bathroom, Sabrina wants to reconfigure completely. Double sinks. <clears throat> Toilet room right here, three and a half by six, and then it's got a good size closet. <clears throat> Very good size closet. I really don't like the cream color trim everywhere. One thing that I do like is these uh, these big casings. Very nice. Everywhere, so that's nice. Doors are solid core. That's nice. Okay, so that's the downstairs. Oh, then there's the loft. Forgot the loft. Let's zip up there real quick. Go up the stairs. <clears throat> it's nice, it has a handrail. We were up one the other day at another house. 
with no handrail, which made it really funky. The loft is long, not real wide, but nice. Okay. Here we go. Head it back down. Okay, so that's the total downstairs. Dark, very dark up here. Made some lights. There we go. Okay, media room. Whoa. Where's the lights? Okay. Little closet with a funky two step to it. Screen would go there, and the distance between those switches, which would max out my big screen TV, is 10 feet, roughly 10 feet wide. This room was at one time painted like black. There's that door outside. Okay, so that's this and oh, looks like two pocket doors. ceiling step up into a closet oh, I don't like the yellow I just don't like the yellow the yellow everywhere there's a Sterling Ridge that's not ideal but double pane windows I don't see the manufacturer of these windows. But they seem okay. Not that you open up windows in Texas anyway. Okay. Now we've got, there's the stairs going down, hallway to what will be chat's room, potentially, and this way is uh, guest, which is nice, has these two doors, which will go out to a balcony, and then there is a ensuite bath with a shower. Let's see if we get a light. Mm. Yeah. And we've got the little battery warning. These are the two manifolds in this closet. Let's go out to Chad's real quick. What would be Chad's room? And it's a pretty good sized room that little notch to it, kind of odd, but nice ceiling, and it 
shower. Decent, uh, decent closet in here. We found the Electrolux Quiet Clean. I love those. Okay. Where's the lights? Okay, backing out. Now let's go out the little girls. No, guest room. See if we can make it. Here's the deck, outside deck. And this room above the garage. Mm, wish it were attached. It's not. What are you going to do? Oh, it's nice and cool out here. And there's a leak in the middle of the room, and you can tell it's been leaking because the flooring's all separated and buckled. When you get down close, you can totally see it. Anyway, so the flooring will need to be replaced. That's a long room. I can't remember. We measured this whole thing, I think. Here's the uh, closet. Then it does have a bathroom with a shower, actually. Not big, but it does have one. And then it's got this little room for a little fridge, water, and then up there. It's a little, little loft. It's not very big. It's like seven feet by 12 feet, something like that. And this does have this separate AC. I doubt it works, but you never know. Let's try it. 